Hi friends, this is Pastor Harley Wheeler with the Broadway United Methodist Church. I want to share with you this uh, verse from the book of Zechariah, chapter 8, verse 7. In the middle of a prophecy that Zechariah has given to the people, it says, Thus says the Lord of hosts, Behold, I will save my people from the east country and from the west country. Now, Zechariah doesn't necessarily need to, to add from the east country and from the west country. He says, if I'm going to save my people, we would assume God is going to save them from wherever they are. But would we assume that? If we'd lived through some pretty hopeless times, and Zechariah's people had lived through some pretty hopeless times. If people knew Zechariah, but not as maybe one of the world's winners, okay? It was known that he was considered a prophet, but uh, did it seem like his life was a happy one? We can't know. We know that the prophets were often mistreated, uh, tradition is that all of them were martyred at one point or another. Zechariah says, God has declared he will save his people from the east and from the west. And so you're supposed to cast your mind and say, well, how far is it that way? How far is it that way? To all these directions and all these places, God will reach to us. I am firmly convinced that God is busy pursuing people who some of them want nothing to do with him. And so God will save from the east and the west. And for us in our world, we've had east and west as different ways of uh, doing politics. And one, for me, represents freedom and one has represented tyranny. And, uh, and in, our, in our country today, we talk about the people on the east coast and the west coast. I'm from the Midwest. We consider ourselves normal here. But people on the east and west coast probably wonder what I'm all about. God will save. God will speak to people. He will call to their deepest need. He has declared, if you seek me, you will find me. Pray for the people that you love. Pray that God will reach them. Amen.